And it is time now for a segment brought to you by one of our favorite organizations, Meals on Wheels Rhode Island. And it is the season of giving. And now through the end of the year, they are about so much more than just food. So here now to explain more is their executive director, our friend Meg Grady. Good morning, Meg. Good morning, Brendan. Welcome back. Thank you. Happy to be here you in person. Multiple roadshow appearances under your belt now, so you're a pro at this. Oh, I love it. Yeah, it's always nice to see you and really to put the spotlight on what you guys are doing. Let's talk about the last couple of years, Meg, because in 2020 and here in 2021, you guys really have not missed a beat, have you? We are so incredibly proud that we operated without disruption during the COVID-19 pandemic. We continue to operate, obviously, with the necessary protocols and safety measures. We surged from 1,200 home-delivered meals to 4,000. It really is remarkable, those numbers, when you elucidate them, when you break them down, and when we can examine them. It's really incredible that you've been able to maintain that pace, which is just great. So let's talk really about the work. You know, I've been out there with you. I've seen firsthand what you do, making those seniors feel less alone alone, helping them to be more safe in their home. That's really what this is all about at its core, isn't it? Meals on Wheels of Rhode Island is much more than a meal. We're a life-saving safety check and an opportunity for socialization. So during the pandemic, many of our clients told us, you're the only person I'm seeing. You're helping me know that I'm going to stay safe in my home and I'll have something to eat. Yeah, when you hear that, it must make you and the team so very proud. It's really incredible. I was out delivering two Thursdays ago, met one of our clients. She's 103 years old. And that must mean the world to her, like you said, that she gets to see you and have that social socialization, which is just great. Now, as an independent nonprofit, you rely on the support of individuals out there. So if people want to contribute, they can do so because you really can't do it without their help. We need our supporters more than ever. $9.61, that sponsors one home-delivered meal. So we're asking people to go on our website, rimeals.org, that's www.rimeals.org, and make a donation because our seniors need us now more than ever. Yeah, and suppose somebody watching right now has a loved one at home, a family friend, someone who's in need, and they think they might want to avail themselves uh, of this service. How do we know if they qualify? What's that process like, Mike? To make a referral, visit our website at www.rimeals.org. You can also give us a call. Our phone number is posted on that website to refer someone to learn more about volunteer opportunities and, of course, to make a donation. And you just alluded to those volunteer opportunities. Let's talk about those because those volunteers, they're in the trenches. They're out there day in and day out making it all happen, aren't they? Our volunteers are delivery heroes. We have needs for volunteers right now in Providence and Pawtucket. Now, you don't have to live there to volunteer there, um, but if you are able to give a day a week, a day a month, give us a call, visit that website. We could use the support. Yeah, many hands make light work as they say, and when everyone comes together, it just allows it all to flow, so to speak. And I know I've been out. Remember I came out there? I did a few deliveries. Uh, Brendan, they wouldn't open the door, <laughs> well, but we got you in. I went out <laughs> before the pandemic. I went out and I helped you. But all kidding aside, yeah. I got to see firsthand really what it means to the people, and that's the name of the game. It was a great experience. Thank you for your support. It really was. The bag was a little heavy for me. Uh, great seeing you as always, Meg. This segment brought to you by Meals on Wheels Rhode Island. To learn more about giving back and how you guys can help out, we'll have links to all of the things that Meg just said to their website at ours, roadshow.com.